Hello guys, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh I'm your tutor, so today I would like to talk about on how to use Adobe Animate CC So if you fire up your Adobe Animate CC, this is what you will see Okay, so this is the interface of your Adobe Animate CC So uh, on your right side, you can see tools, okay And there are properties and library here So if you can't find this, so you can just go to window And then you can just enable all of these things alright so let's just proceed okay on the bottom side of this software you can see timeline and output timeline is where all the keyframes happen and then the output is when you execute the project and then some output will be displayed here alright so uh, in this tutorial we will use action script 3.0 and please don't be confused with Action Script 3.0 class. Okay, this is a different thing. And what we will use is Action Script 3.0. So let's just click on this. So a white canvas will appear here, and then as you can see, our timeline is also active. Right now we have a keyframe here. Okay, the keyframe here. Or maybe you cannot see it, but never mind. This is a keyframe. So uh, in my timeline, okay. My timeline, as you can see, there are numbers and also uh, an indicator uh, indicating the time of our timeline. So the standard one is 24 frames is equals to one second. So if you multiply it, and then you got something like this. Okay. So um, as a start. Uh, I would like to show to you guys something like this Okay So this is your frame Okay So all of this We call it as frames Okay, or timeline but if you see something like this okay, meaning you are going to put something in the frame in a single frame okay. if you see something like this okay, meaning there is an object inside the frame as you can see here Previously, okay, the color is like this, and now the color is like this, meaning there are objects here in the canvas. Okay, uh, I think that is the basic one, and then the other things that you have to know is how to use the tool. Okay, there is the selection tool, which is uh, you can use this, uh, you know, to um, what do you call uh, move an object. Okay. and then uh, this free transform tool okay which is you can use it to uh, expand or shrink your image you also have pen tool you have oval tool you have rectangular tool okay and you have bone okay to make something move and you also have frame bucket tool and other than that is uh, you can also see the history okay uh, for example, if you have execute something and then it will appear here, okay. And you can also increase the size of this canvas. Say right now is uh, 550 times 400 pixel. So uh, and also the frame per second is 24. As I say here. Okay, done.